So he played the national championship game and also got drafted, uh, what, like a week later. Um, so how was that week in your life and just the transitional period for you? Uh, I feel like it all just happened right before my eyes. I couldn't even, I didn't even have time to think. So just like coming home, taking it in that we didn't win this year, and then three days later being drafted to Los Angeles was obviously one of the best moments of my life. I've been waiting a dream for something like this. So to hear my name called on TV that night was amazing. Um, honestly, I'm happy that it was so fast because I didn't have time to get anxious and crazy and start thinking all kinds of things. I just like happened. It came came up right away and um, I was on to the new a new chapter in my life right away. Um, you kind of spoke on it uh, up there um, about you know, growing up playing outside, but I've heard a lot of players say like there's a style difference between like players that come from like the East Coast and West Coast. Have you noticed kind of that like style difference um, in your basketball career so far? Yeah. Uh, obviously, like there's players from California that are great, and then there's players from Jersey, New York that are great. Um, I just feel like it's a different style of play. Uh, a lot less of a system in um, the East Coast. I feel like a lot of people are outside playing pickup all day. There's not as many trainers. Not to say that Jersey doesn't have trainers nowadays, but when I, when I was practicing, there was not as many trainers. I never trained with anybody, but I feel like in LA, there's so many trainers, so many people that are helping these kids do drills after drills. So I feel like you come out as different players. Not not to say that one is better than the other, it's just a lot different. And um, one last question. I mean, obviously you want to win and um, help Spars have the best possible season they can, but what are your personal goals for yourself and what's your expectations that you have for yourself this season? Uh, honestly, my personal goals this year are just to, uh, to be the best teammate I can be. I, I'm starting from the bottom again. I worked my way up in college, and now I'm gonna have to do the same thing here. So just knowing that um, it's gonna be a long ride and a long way up to the top, like where all these people, all these veterans on my team are. So just soaking up and learning as much as I can from them, having an open mind, knowing that I can still play and being confident, but also knowing that they've had a lot more experience than me, and my time will come, and to be ready at all times. Thank you, I appreciate it.